I really believe that uh, sometimes you have to provide the energy. Uh, it's been a long time since we've won. Uh, you know, we come down to the last possession with Colorado, we don't make the shot. Last possession with UNLV, we don't make the shot. And pretty soon you start just getting into that mode where, hey, if we play close, that's good enough. Well, that's not good enough for me, and that should never be good enough for our team. And so uh, we needed today's victory. Yeah, no, we definitely need it. We hadn't won a game in a while, and, you know, starting conference, that last one was kind of a tough one for us. But we need to get one back back at home, and um, with the amount of fans that were here today, it, was, it felt good to win. I think the glue to this group is Jordan Kelly. Jordan, once again, uh, steps up with 15 points, 8 rebounds, has 10 assists. More importantly, Jordan likes contact. And the games are more physical in conference play, and you can't shy back from all the contact. And Jordan can execute and play within that framework and uh, was very important for today's victory. No, I mean, I figured I had maybe get close to a double-double with, like, rebounds and points or something, but I didn't, I didn't think that. Yeah, a little early on in, in the game, we – we just weren't setting the tempo for ourselves is what we were playing at their level. And it is a lot different for us because, you know, Markel is normally the one who's pushing the ball down the floor. But I think today, I think we handled it ex extremely well, more than we could have hoped for. Yeah, I thought at the start, you know, we were a little timid. And uh, that's where Jordan comes in and plays a big part for us. And having her in the starting lineup has really helped. But yet she got us going and then I ended up making sure we continued to keep going. And I thought there was a lull in it where it looked like we were able to transition and make some easy baskets, but we had to make sure we were only going to transition when the opportunity was there. And then when it wasn't, to be able to execute what we were trying to do offensively. And when we started doing that, then I thought we started playing really well in all phases of the game offensively. I think so. It definitely builds up confidence for for our team and whatnot, but um, I think CSU is def definitely going to be a better team than what we just played, and they're going to be very different. So i uh, got to have a different mindset and uh, come ready to play again, I guess. The challenge now next week is we play the two best teams uh, in our league. Uh, we get Colorado State at home and Boise State on the road, so it doesn't get easier for this group. As I told them, that when we play together, uh, we make the next pass. Uh, we're pretty good. People shoot when they're ready, focused, balanced. We get shots made. When we're not, we're just throwing the ball up there. And that's something that uh, we got to be able to carry forward.